Hello everyone, my name is Vic of EUS Market Biz, and in this video I am going to share with you a very high potential coin and also I'm going to share with you its website so that we can understand further the project alright so let's begin so coin market cap I think there's um, green C right so prices are doing good right now so let's go to the um, token that I'm going to share so it's called DAV coin so it's ranked um, currently ranked 647 in coin market cap and you can get this token in BitForex, Bilexi, LA token, hit BTC, I and IDEX. Okay, so its coin market cap is two million four hundred ninety-seven thousand US dollars. Its market market cap rather. So its vo volume in the twenty-four hour period is thirty-eight thousand US dollars. Circulating supply. Is 454 million DAV. The total supply is 1 billion 380 million DAV. Okay, so you can access this um, their website by clicking website here, or you can type directly code DAV that network. All right, so the prices are doing good right now. Okay, so let's go to their website. So DAV is Decentralized Autonomous Vehicles, it is the coin of transportation. It's a blockchain-based transportation protocol that is enabling a decentralized peer-to-peer -peer global transportation network. Okay, so they're building a decentralized infrastructure to revolutionize the transportation industry on the blockchain. Okay, so the DAV overview on the left side, the first Australian company to utilize DAV protocol for shipping and logistics. On the right side so these are the two videos found here and their um, social media links are also here so um, their uh, telegram their cacao their twitter their github their youtube their linkedin their reddit their facebook their medium okay so if you're a developer and you want to contribute to the dev software since dev is an open source software you can go to GitHub and contribute to the DAV community or join the DAV community rather. Okay, and also subscribe on their YouTube channel. So DAV's protocol allows anyone to utilize transportation services or put their own man or autonomous vehicles on the network, creating a decentralized peer-to-peer -peer transportation ecosystem. Okay. So their technology, so DAV is a framework of open source software, open source hardware, and a free decentralized marketplace where anyone can buy and sell autonomous transportation services. So their technology consists of three major components. Centralized discovery, trustless cooperation tools, and communication protocol. So decentralized discovery. So DAV allows autonomous vehicles to discover each other, as well as service providers and clients around them. DAV implements decentralized node discovery using a peer-to-peer -peer protocol that does not rely on a central server. Instead, nodes are listed in a distributed hash table, which can be accessed in an extremely efficient way. So, communication pro protocol. DAB defines a library of standardized communication protocols for various transportation scenarios. This communication is divided into two groups on blockchain communication, done directly by calling smart contracts and through events emitted by those smart contracts. Off blockchain communication, done peer to peer using DAB's protocols. Trustless cooperation tools. So trustless cooperation between buyers and sellers for all transportation services is achieved using a series of, of specialized smart contracts. These smart contracts these smart contracts enable multi-party contracts between buyer, seller, and when needed between arbitrator, insurer, and others. These contracts are tied into directly to the DAO token, guaranteeing financial resolution or transaction between multiple parties without requiring any pre-established trust. So let's check um, their protocols. So these are community built modules. So 
first one is the drone charging network so it connects drones and charging stations on an open network where they can buy and sell charging services using to have tokens so currently it is being offered in northern Italy with five charging stations and it has been made possible by one of their alliance members so this is also very very um, very very important since we don't know um, when will our battery run out or we forgot to charge our drone or, for, or, or we forgot to um, bring an extra okay so as you can see here's a sample of the app it will show us a map and it will guide us it will pop up there um, drone charging networks right so that is the first module the second one is the drone flight planning so it's the, where drones pass the waypoints of their planned trip and drone planner bids to offer a service in charge for DAO tokens once a mission has been awarded the, ser the service provider returns a list of coordinates to fly through so that the drone can reach its destination safely this flight plan takes into consideration environmental, topographical, and regulatory considerations. So currently it's being offered in Nevada, USA by one of their alliance member. Uh, as you can see, here's a sample of the app also, which is very, very important. Because you know, uh, it'll monitor your um, drone where... Um, when will it arrive at its destination like that so that's drone flight planning the next one is the drone missions app so the missions uh, is the first app built to showcase the DAV ecosystem um, it connects users looking to ship packages with autonomous drones users request drone services drones bid for those services and trustless cooperation is enabled by using the blockchain An integration with the first Drone partner Copter Express is underway. Alright, so the next one are more on the software part. So it's the DevC line tested. So the command line interface tool was built to make developing applications and services that interact with Dev a much more pleasant experience. It allows developers to easily run a local testnet containing Dev contracts, generate identities secured by private and public keys, and register them on the blockchain. This allows anyone to easily scaffold new projects or modify an existing one to interact with DAV and more. So the current status for this is fully functioning testnet and identity generation already used by foundation projects. Work on connecting the registration functionality with the, with the identity smart contract is in progress. So the DAV developer portal. So their developer portal incorporates API documentation, communication protocols and instructions for running the command line interface, local testnet, and block explorer. So the current status is multiple communication protocols written and a user guide for their CLI tools is now available. The next one is the block explorer. So the block explorer allows users to explore local Ethereum testnets. This eases development and debugging for developers building apps and services on top of that. So the current status is work is underway to package the block explorer enabling it to launch now automatically from the DAO CLI tools. The next one is the mission control. So mission control serves as a discovery and communication layer that connects and keeps track of vehicles, users, and services. So the status for this is fully working for running simulated environments with, the, with drone deliveries currently being expanded to support the vehicles of their first partners. Okay, so the next one is the autonomous boat. So autonomous boat is named Nemo. So Nemo will demonstrate true autonomy by spending money to take care of its own needs, allowing it to operate independently for long periods at sea. So Nemo, when Nemo runs low in energy, it connects to the DAV network, purchase and pay for charging services with DAV tokens and after it charges, heads back to sea. Okay, so this is very, very um, nice. The next one is the search and rescue robots. So they have partnered with the Sarian, a robotics prototyping company. So they're, they're developing a POC involving an autonomous robotic rover that will perform drone search and rescue missions. 
So their overall bid for missions to look at drones that have lost contact with their owners, go to their last known location, and even using, I mean, and then using its onboard lidar and computer vision, find them and send back their exact coordinates. Rossbot computer vision and algorithms are being updated to support identifying drones. So as you can see, here are their community development modules. And they've made a lot already, so this is very, very great. So here's what I've been talking about. So interested in working on DAV's open source technology, join their developer community on, on GitHub. Okay, so the roadmap and quarter four, we're, what are we going to expect? So decentralized discovery, decentralized communication. Right, so the white paper is also here, it's downloadable, their team of advisors, okay, their main team, their CEO, their co-founders, their staff, their developers, uh, open source contributors, and staffs and open source software. Right, so their DAV Alliance. DAV Alliance brings together members of the transportation industry so that they may collaborate on standards and innovation for the global centralized network. So you can join their lines by clicking this one. And there's going to be a form at the bottom of these of this page. Like uh, here it is. So just fill out this form and then click join alliance, right? So the DAV Alliance is a coalition of enterprises, innovators, and leaders in the transportation industry. Their purpose is to bring together members of the, transport, of the transportation industry so that they may collaborate on innovations and standards for a global decentralized network. So here are the benefits of joining the alliance. So shared knowledge and influence in blockchain technology and the DAV protocol. And the DAV alliance members will be at the forefront of decentralized transportation and autonomous vehicle adoption by the mainstream. It is their goal to help bring this remarkable technology to the world and to share the benefits and successes with their first, I mean, with their members. Okay, so here are their members. All right. Okay, so let's go back. So their invitation to their Telegram, their YouTube channel, some facts about DAV. Okay, so DAV. Um, that is their website okay so as you can see it's very very uh, full of information yeah, right so I think you already know what DAV is based on what I've shown you so DAV right keep, uh, keep note of this one or include this one in your research list okay so guys before I go I just want to say that I am not a financial advisor and everything I see here is not a recommendation for you to buy and sell crypto. You must always do your own research before signing for yourself. Okay, guys, guys, don't forget um, if you want to uh, uh, join Initiative Q, use my invite link at the description below, right? And if you also want to um, get rewarded in crypto, uh, download Lumius at your favorite app store in your or in Google Play Store, so it's a social service on, on the blockchain. Give feedback and get rewarded in crypto. Okay. And also, if you are if you are an EOS holder, and if you want to book a flight, okay, you just visit EOSmarket.biz because this website will give you a link where you can um, book a flight with 70 or up to 70 percent discount by clicking early market here okay and if you have some items that are for sale in your house there or your place rather so there are two marketplace websites here so pcn marketplace and eos marketplace and preferred currency dot news is also here so this one is a subscription website where you can drive for $15 a month or $180 a year okay to get notified of the latest updates on cryptocurrencies also the news website okay 
so dev token guys uh, this has been Vic bringing you the latest and the newest crypto related news okay thank you bye bye